Onision, you creepy son of a bitch. You know, a little piece of me dies inside every time I'm reminded of Onision's existence, so I really never expected to do another video on him, but in light of recent events, here we are. So an article on Heat Street recently explained that Onision has a message board in which a ton of really underage girls, we're talking ages 11 through 17, post really scantily clad, basically nude pictures of themselves and their bodies for him to rate them. Now, keep in mind that despite Onision's really disturbing attempts at looking like a 14-year-old boy, he actually is 31 years old with a wife and a kid. And if after me saying that, you are questioning the sanity of any woman who would actually marry Onision, you'd be right to question her. She's a YouTuber as well. Her name is Lainey Bot, and she is non-binary and thinks that she switches between male and female daily. So, but back to the story. So these are really, really young girls on his message board. Like I said, ages 11 through 17, they post really revealing pictures all the time for him to rate their bodies. Um, we're talking 13 year olds posing in panties for a 31 year old man. And the schizo actually has no shame about this and what he's doing because he actually puts these pictures in videos and rates them for the entire world to see. So it's a ton of middle school and high school girls having their nearly naked bodies immortalized on Onision's really huge channel for this 31-year-old man to pass judgment on them and say if they're hot or not. Smells like some fucking pedo shit. And the greatest irony of it all is that, remember, Onision is like the biggest male feminist on the internet, and he's constantly virtue signaling about how women should be respected and how he's a feminist, and it's like... Is that really feminist behavior to rate and ridicule and mock the bodies of young girls in your videos? So obviously I'm not going to post these girls' pictures on my video, but let's look at some of the posts on his message board. I have to wear glasses because I'm blind. I'm not gonna tell you how old I really am because I'm in a few videos of you and it would cause your problems. Ha ha ha, I'm under 18. And there's another post with a young girl who is friends with someone who was in Onision's video, basically begging him to take the pictures down because it's not safe for a 13-year-old's body to be seen by hundreds of thousands of people. And he never actually did edit out the girl. He actually made fun of her in the video, this 13-year-old girl saying that she has low self-esteem. What the fuck is wrong with you? And Onision actually responded to the article and the accusations and said that in his defense, he hasn't actually asked the young girls to post the pictures. But in my opinion, first of all, you never stopped it. You never set up some sort of rules that you couldn't post pictures like that on your website. You never set up some sort of age verification thing on your website. And by you creating videos using these young girls' pictures, it actually creates incentive for more young girls to post pictures because they'll want to be in your video. I'm really disgusted by this, and I'm kind of shocked that there aren't more YouTubers calling this behavior out. I mean, back when he made a response video to me earlier this year, all my comment sections were just like inundated with super young girls going to bat for him. And obviously, it's not his fault if his videos attract really young people. I mean, there are people who are famous among kids all the time. But his behavior with that audience is what's really gross. I mean, I saw like a couple weeks ago, he was like going on this tangent about how he loves making girls orgasm. And if you look at the replies to that tweet, it's like nothing but 13 year old girls with Snapchat filter profiles. I'm just like, dude, why would you tweet that if everyone who follows you is a fucking eighth grader? I mean, personally, if that was one of my kids in one of fucking Onision's videos, I'd be out for fucking blood. Another thing to remember is that this isn't exactly shocking as Onision was 27 when he started dating his 17 year old now wife. So clearly this is his thing. Onision, you are a creepy piece of shit. And I know you're watching this because you're an egomaniac and I know this is just giving you attention, but this is unacceptable and I actually am ashamed to share a platform with you. And go ahead, do what you did last time, send your horde of tweens to Urban Dictionary to write stupid posts about me. Let's define Blair White as black and white wildcats. You tend to see roaming city streets covered in their own vomit and urine. Make sure you tweet at Onision when you posted this definition to Urban Dictionary so we can all celebrate these wonderful Blair Whites. Cause I don't care. I'm calling you out and I hope other YouTubers do as well. So bitch, you're still in the wrong. Anyways, I hope everyone had a really good Christmas. I know I did. It was nice to end. <laughs> such a tone shift. It was nice to end this really crazy year with family and relax and when I tell you I have plans for 2017 girl, I have plans for 2017. Said that twice. Anyways, love ya!